how to convert audio files using Switch. This tutorial demonstrates how to use the Switch Audio Converter software, which is a useful program for converting your audio files so you can edit them in a sound editing program. You can download Switch from the internet. It works for both Macs and PCs. There's a premium version you can purchase. There's also a free version you can download for simple tasks. The first thing you want to be aware of when dealing with digital audio files are what kind of files you're dealing with. Most digital audio recorders will save audio files in one of the following formats. A WMA, which is a Windows Media Audio File. WAV, which is an uncompressed Windows Audio File. AIFF, which is an uncompressed Macintosh file in a standard podcasting format. Or MP3, which is the most universal kind of audio file. So you want to know how your audio recorder saves the file, and you also want to know what format you'll need to import that file into your audio editing software. And there's two common audio editing programs for beginners. One is GarageBand, which is available on uh, Macintosh, and if you're using GarageBand, you want to convert your files into AIFF in order to import. Another common audio editing program is Audacity, which works on both Macintosh and PCs. If you're going to use Audacity, you want to convert your files into a WAV format to import. So the first thing you want to do uh, when dealing with your digital audio recorder is plug it into your USB, which I've done. I'm going to open my folders, and I'm going to drag my audio files onto my desktop so that I can deal with them. Second thing you always want to do is make a copy of these files in case something happens to them in the editing process. You don't want them to become corrupted. So I select them on a Mac. I hit control click. I just say duplicate. And now I have copies of these. And I'll put the originals away for safekeeping. So now I'm ready to con convert my files. And as you can see, these have the extension of WMA. And uh, so I need to convert them if I want to use either GarageBand or Audacity. So I've downloaded Switch. And I'm going to open it. Uh, it's very simple to use. What I want to do is just uh, select my files and pull them into the workspace. You can see that they're right there. And then you want to look for a couple things. First of all, the output format, uh, and you can select from a lot of different uh, files here. Uh, if you wanted to use GarageBand, it's AIFF. Again, if you want to use Audacity, WAV. I'm going to select AIFF. The second thing you want to do is uh, click this box that says Output in Same Folder as Source Files. That just means that it, when it makes a copy and converts the files, it'll put them in the same location, just so you know where they are. So I've clicked those boxes, I come over here, click Convert, and it's converting my files. And now you'll see that I have uh, copies of all my files with a new extension, AIFF, and I'm ready to put them into GarageBand.